Dion, you might have read somewhere we're looking for a left back. I think we might have just found one. <laughs> yeah, um, yeah, you have. Um, I was originally a centre mid, but having filled in at Chesterfield for the last two years at left back, I'm got quite used to that position now, and it was obviously unfortunate what happened um, to the last left back here. Um, but I'm just uh, excited to to start now. So. But there is a bit of versatility about you. You say you can play a midfield as well. Yeah, um, that's where I like to play. Um, that's where I was playing growing up. Um, but obviously, it's it's nice now to know that I can play in other positions because you never know when when the squad needs you to fill in for them. And obviously, that's, I'm just happy to play. So it gives me the better chance of getting on the field also. Well, you were playing for Chesterfield as recently as last Saturday, so when does Portsmouth actually come onto your radar? Um, it was the start of the week where um, I got the phone call saying that Portsmouth were interested, um, to which I obviously replied, <laughs> I want to come, obviously. Um, and then, as I think the first bid uh, went in, I think Tuesday was it? Uh, so that's when it really, that's when it really hit me that it was it was looks like it was going to happen so i'm just i'm just excited to be here i'm i'm grateful to be here and can't wait to get going should i ask what was the attraction when they said portsmouth are interested uh well not really it's the sheer size of the club um it's a massive club it's a it's a great opportunity um i just as i said i'm really excited to to get going and obviously the club this big the ambitions they've got um, just hoping for a good season and and yeah, just excited. What sort of left back are you? A left back that likes to bomb ahead and create chances at the other end? Um, yeah, I'd, um, I'd say I'm definitely better going forward. I'm I'm more of a forward thinking player than obviously a defensive. So yeah, I like I like to be up the pitch. Um, but I also like the game to be ahead of me. So left back is is a perfect position for me really. Mm. Um, yeah, so I like it there. Yeah. There have been difficult times at Chesterfield over the last two years, but y you know a lot about the league. Yeah, well, I've, uh, I've had two seasons in League One now. Um, obviously for Chesterfield, it was, it's was it been a difficult couple of years, um, but I'm sure, I'm sure we're going to do well. And I know the league, um, and uh, I just, I honestly just can't wait to get going now. I'm just excited to put the the blue shirt on. You're getting towards the mid-twenties, is this where you've got to make a statement and, and kick on? Yeah, definitely, um, and I think this is definitely the, the right platform to do that. Uh, the size of the club, it's it's an honour to, to put on the Pompey shirt, so it's definitely the right time for me now to, to kick on and, and further my career, so yeah, I'm, I'm just glad to, that this is the place for me to do that. And playing before big crowds obviously would give you a bit of a buzz. Yeah, I've played in front of a couple of big crowds but um, to have a big crowd at home obviously will will be new to me and probably will be special. Uh, but yeah, there's, there's a couple of big teams in League One, uh, especially this year now with the teams that have come down. Um, but yeah, this, this club is definitely up there with, with the rest of them. So. And Pompey have just come into this league you know in the league as you do, do you think it's a good marriage? Yeah, it's definitely. A, a club a club of this size it should never have been down there in the, in the beginning, so I think the club's on the up. Um, league One, I, I'd say the club itself is obviously bigger than League One, I think everyone knows that, but it's time to establish yourselves now and, and yeah, kick on now for myself and for the club, so I just can't wait to get going. Great way to end, thank you. Thank you.